Let's talk about uh, basic anatomy of the heart and also the vascular system of the body. You know, you have a you have a right sided heart and you have a left sided heart. Your blood comes from the superior vena cava and inferior vena cava. From the veins, it drains into the right atrium. From the right atrium, that's the upper chamber of the heart, it goes to the right ventricle. From the right lower ventricle, the lower chamber, it goes to the pulmonary arteries. From pulmonary arteries, it goes, it goes to both the lungs where it gets oxygenated and then from the lungs it goes to the left side of the heart. When it goes to the left side of the heart, through four pulmonary veins, it drains into the left atrium. From left atrium, it drains into the left ventricle. Left ventricle is the most important chamber of the heart because this is the one which has to pump the blood to the entire body, right? Against so much pressure. And from there, it goes into the aorta. Aorta keeps giving branches like a carotid artery, subclavian artery, and it gives you eccentric arteries. Um, renal arteries and then it goes down and divides into two major vessels which supply the blood to the lower extremity. And then you have a venous system where it drains the blood from the entire body into the superior and inferior vena cava into the right side of the heart. While doing that, it also goes through the, to the kidneys, excrete the waste materials and then it goes to the right side of the heart. This is a, this is a um, basic anatomy um, and the vasculature in the body.